I've moved them to a different location. I just went through the roof. Another one of those nice frames. So this is what you want your your uh, your your cell starter. Uh, larva out here, really. I've got a cover that's obviously like chock full of beans. Hey guys, thanks for joining me again. Today is uh, gonna be a quick video, but today is day two of our graft. Um, I grafted on Tuesday, today's Thursday, and I just wanna check to see in the progress uh, of how our grafts are doing. So, you know, gonna use a little bit of smoke, um, hive tool, and a brush just to, uh, you know, if we can't see, we'll just brush away some bees to see how things are going, okay? So here we go. marked in my graph frame so that makes it easy to see there's no question of you know where is it Really nice takes, guys. I don't know. Ah, we've already got some nice drawn out queen cells. This is day two, and you can see the cups are just chock full of royal jelly. You know, we missed a few here and there. But, uh, you know, this was exactly what I was hoping for. You know, maybe I'll get a 75% a take or so. And, uh, you know, there's Two, four, six, seven, eight, ten, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, eighteen, nineteen, uh, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four. So twenty-four grass right now. Look really, really nice. And I'm just gonna put these back in here. So. said yeah 20 24 graphs taken out of a total of 34 so 10 didn't take um, totally happy with that and uh, really stoked all right so uh, the next step will be to start thinking about um, making up your queenless nukes and I've always had good success by taking either the queen cells to another yard where the nukes are or breaking another couple hives up and bringing them uh, here, but I mean ideally you'd probably want to you know if you want to mix your genetics up bring your queen cells um, to another area um, Three miles away ideally so you're gonna get a, a variance of genetics in there because you don't want to start increasing your bees uh, too much so um, something to think about but uh, and I've got to think about it, but um, Yeah, we'll see you back here in uh, eight days for um, that'll be about day 14 to 
uh, move our queen cells before they emerge into the queen mating nukes and and then we really won't uh, check on them maybe we'll pop into a couple and see if they emerge properly but otherwise let them be for uh, two to three weeks um, ideally three and come back and typically you'll see uh, the bees you know or the queen has already laid up eggs obviously but you may even see some milk brood and cat brood so anyway um, that's it for now thanks for joining me